Welcome back guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to easily kill Medusa. Before you get to this mission, which is Writhing Dead, in which you have to kill Medusa, you'll first have to play this side quest, Romancing the Stone Garden, which you get to play in Lesbos. It's one of the side quests you can find in Petrified Valley. Once you talk to the woman, uh, there's a small fight in which you'll have to kill about four men, four soldiers and then again talk to the same woman, her name is Breeze and then she'll take you to the place, Dread Ruins there you find the petrified temple and the door to Writhing Dead's lair once you're done with that, continue with the next quest which is hard to Artemis so you'll have to reach the Huntress village on Chios so that's where the artifact is key to open the door of this petrified temple Brice, wait. Lydia. Lydia. okay now starts the gameplay inside the temple Brice, you have no idea what Okay, now let's get straight to meet Medusa. Only one man speaks of turning victims to stone. And here is the entrance. Okay, so first of all, make sure you have two important abilities assigned guys. One is Second Wind, which is a health restoring ability. I use that throughout the game, it's very helpful. And another one is Devastating Shot, which is useful when you use your bow and arrow. And these two abilities consume just one adrenaline bar at a time, right? So, at the very beginning she deploys these stone men couple soldiers shouldn't be too hard just uh, kill them fight them like you fight the normal soldiers it's pretty easy and these thunderstorms see this one so when she does that she does that every time after she uses that rays coming out of her eyes uh, make sure those rays don't fall on you that's the one that freezes you uh, you become stone temporarily for a couple seconds this is the one so whenever she uses that just stand behind the pillars alright there are about six to eight pillars just go stand behind them and once she she's done with that she immediately uses this uh, thunderstorm right so just make sure you don't stand in the place where you're standing when she uses that just keep moving around that should be more than enough to avoid those so uh, that's simple enough so all you have to do is just stand behind the pillars and start using your bow and arrows alright just don't try close combat don't get close to her it's gonna be a hard time doing that never use your swords to kill her that's not gonna work just use your bow and arrow and specifically the death arrows alright that arrow is very powerful and along with that you use this devastating shot ability it's really powerful and also make sure you have at least one or two adrenaline bars left so you gotta use those to restore your health and also you need that to use this devastating shot ability alright so make sure you have at least one or two left don't just empty it otherwise you'll have to wait until that refills you gotta wait for her to deploy those uh, stone men fight them and then refill your adrenaline bars so Make sure you don't use them all 
pretty quickly carefully use them and it's very simple guys just stand behind the pillars or wait when she is about to use those rays from her eyes to freeze you that's your time so just stand behind the pillars and when she does that try to give her a headshot those rays won't even touch you behind the pillar but still you should be able to exactly give her a headshot all you have to do is just wait for her to use those rays at that time use your bone arrow and make sure you use the ability devastating shot and give her a headshot right and immediately after that when she deploys the thunderstorm move around just leave that place keep running around and that's all you have to do use your arrow and move around from the thunderstorm just keep moving between the pillars don't get close to her okay so it's a very simple trick just use those abilities move around between the pillars use your bone arrow devastating shot and then dodge the thunderstorm that's it by doing this you should be able to pretty easily kill her in between she'll again deploy those stone men refill the adrenaline bars that's again useful for you and not so hard just make sure you don't fall under those rays okay make sure you those rays don't touch you it's again not so hard just temporary it slows you down by freezing you for a couple of seconds but if you avoid that it's better the artifact and transformed into that creature I wonder how many people have become the writhing dread over the centuries Someone, I tell you, in another time, will remember us. <laughs>